Hello, I'm Shyla Catherine. I'm delighted that you're interested in this program on the mirror of mindfulness. This program is a bit different than most of my Bodhi courses offerings that are structured as teacher-led group courses. This is an at-home self-guided retreat package. Self-retreat can be a marvelous experience. It has the potential to profoundly deepen our meditative experience and we don't even have to leave our home. Self-retreats can help us integrate mindfulness into the environment that we live in. But it's not always easy. It's not always easy to meditate at home, often because we look around and there are many distractions, habitual distractions, things that call our attention that we think are so much more important sometimes than actually meditating or cultivating the mind. So to do an at-home retreat practice, it can be helpful to have some additional support and a clear retreat structure so that even if we encounter habitual distractions or various obligations related to our home life, we'll have the support of the retreat to bring the, that perception into the field of the meditative awareness and to work with it mindfully and wisely. I had the delightful experience of teaching an online weekend retreat in the summer of 2020 and it was on the theme of mindfulness of mind. It was a practice period that focused on this third foundation of mindfulness and this is a topic that is very dear to my heart. And after the course many students they wanted to do it again and they suggested that um, I put together the recorded materials into a kind of retreat package and I thought what a great idea. Since I actually had recorded many of those teachings and guided meditations, I had some material right at, at, at hand, and I was able to use that as the basis for designing this course as a sequence of teachings and guided meditations to support an at-home, self-guided weekend retreat experience. Now, I designed it with the idea of a weekend in mind. So I was thinking a Friday night, teaching and meditation, practice with teachings and guided meditations during the day, all day Saturday, and then winding up with a morning practice on Sunday, ending around midday on Sunday, assuming that, you know, before people go to work again on Monday, perhaps there's other things that they have to take care of and organize in their daily lives. So I had that sort of weekend idea in mind, but it's a self-guided retreat. So this structure is quite flexible. It isn't necessary to do it over a weekend. And for some people, it might be better to do it instead of as a weekend to do take four consecutive mornings, for example. So I adapted an alternative a schedule and sequence of teachings for four consecutive mornings where one could do intensive practice perhaps from wake up until noon, but then in the afternoon take care of work or family uh, business and matters that are um, that you have um, uh, obligations to in your in your daily life. Alternatively, you could also use this material if you're not able to, to do a weekend or four consecutive days. You could make a commitment, for example, to four Saturdays a month and stretch it out over the course of a month and divide it up into four practice periods in that way. It's really quite flexible, but however you choose to use it, I hope that you enjoy the material and let it enrich your meditative experience and your exploration of the mind. And I hope that it can provide a very um, solid and, and, and supportive uh, container and um, structure to support the discipline of an at-home self-guided retreat on the theme of mindfulness of mind, the mirror of mindfulness.